swimming with it. Got him. Ah. What's up guys? Welcome back to another episode of Tide Fishing Adventure. So today, um, guys, I'm at a brand new um, location. Never been here before. I'm um, just going to try to get some uh, fishing going. It's been tough here fishing during the uh, winter, but me and my good buddy, so you guys may recognize him, Scott Hollywood Outdoors. Um, we decided to come up here and make a little run up to Alexandria, Scott? We're in Alexandria? Yeah, we're in Alexandria. Okay. Alexandria. Try to see if we can get some fish going up here and uh, see. This will be, I'm still looking for that first bass of 2019. So here we go. Let's make a couple casts to see what we can do here. That's why I'm worried about setting this first hook set and going straight down into the water. Alright guys, so I'm trying out the uh, Corrado DC here, and the first thing I'm going to throw around is this little uh, floating rattle trap deal. Alright guys, so the tide's still man, out here at the 4 mile run, uh, still fishing, got me and my buddy. Scott Hollywood out here to try to get to some more water. Getting stabbed and poked and prodded by everything over here. But I'll show you guys. Take you guys along with me here. here. Oh here we go. This is what I need right here. Yes. That's what I was looking for. Let's over so far. You got any luck so far? So guys, started things off doing a little uh, drop shot around, um, right around this bridge. Then I switched over to a jig. Um, was doing the uh, David Walker cross eye jig in black with a uh, mystery tackle box black uh, crawl trailer on there um, just something made it so I, I felt like I wanted to put on an all like an all black deal I was gonna switch to like a green pumpkin and black but just kept it with all black that jig guys I got on a black jig in this nice clear water first bite top of the lip crawl using that same MTB box trailer and the day David Walker cross eye jig check it out Whew. yes first bass guys let's go there he goes he's off 
against this bridge, and I just missed one right on that side. All right, guys, want to move again? Try to find Hollywood here and see what we can get going. But um, yeah, so far totals one fish landed. I'm um, still looking for some more, so we'll see see how we can do here. All right, all right, guys. So we'll say about halfway through the trip here. So far, only got one fish on. Um, so far, still looking for maybe two and three, four and five, or to try to put something together. So I'm still trying. Uh, we'll still see. So far, the only thing I've landed is on this Kronark and his favorite rod, throwing a jig. And I'm um, still going to keep that jig in my hand, but going to keep my mind open and see in case something changes because we got a little bit more tide, a little bit more movement going on now. So I might be able to pick up something that's moving a little bit faster and maybe get a bite. So going to keep trying. We'll see. <laughs> That's funny. Guys, my man down here is lighting him up. He didn't cost four while I'm still making a cast. I'm still on one jerkbait cast. It's really got one. Got one? Yeah, barely hooked up. Jeez. For my run. Strong little guy. Let's get him back. Got him. There you go, Hollywood. There you go, Hollywood. All right, guys. So wrapping up today, we're out here at uh, Four Mile Run. Um, so had a pretty good day so far. Uh, managed to get on two fish myself. Hollywood here managed to get on one himself. Um, caught mine on a jig and a jerk bait. He caught his on a fluke. So go figure. You got to kind of keep throwing and cast until you finally figure out what the fish won and uh, try to make the most of that opportunity there when you get it so had a great day out here man I've had a blast it's definitely time to go get some food though we've been out here for say about three and a half maybe four hours somewhere around there um, just casting walking up and down this area having a good time so I'm um, about to go get some eat but something to eat but guys definitely check out my buddy here um, I'll link his channel below but this is Scott Hollywood outdoors um, he's got an excellent channel always doing some tournaments catching some giant fish and has a good time on the water and of course mine um, Bass and Fury, so check out mine at Bass and Fury. So appreciate you guys. What's up, man? Appreciate you guys tuning in. Hit that subscribe button. Make sure you like the video. And I'll check you guys out here. Um, check you guys out in um, a little bit. Nothing. Thanks. Yeah, almost got me. All right. Oh, God. Yeah.